I've always been keen on weather I, since I was a kid. So it, it's it just to me doing what I do is is just it just comes natural and it's just sort of a an inherent interest that I have, and it just makes it that much more fun and uh, enjoyable to do. The research I generally do is looking at how uh, how well there's, there's a couple areas. One one is the, the surface how the surface can uh, initiate storms or convection in the atmosphere. So looking at how vertical motion happens in the lower parts of the atmosphere, how that will initiate thunderstorms. So that's one component. And the other uh, is looking at uh, just storms and severe weather in general. So looking at you know uh, why storms are severe as opposed to other times and, and, uh, and uh, issues like that. Well, the, the fact is, you know, it's, it's, there's a lot of people that work uh, in the natural environment and also the, the human side of things. So we've been, uh, we've been working a little bit with the, um, with the emergency management folks, for example, so with the province and things like that, because they're, they're, they're keen on, 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 you know, better ways to inform people when, particularly when severe weather happens. So we're trying to figure out ways that they can actually get information firsthand to help them in their emergency preparation uh, sides of things. In terms of uh, warning, uh, you know, warning, getting the word out to the public, dissemination is what it's called.